Do you know that a lot of your success depends actually on how you spend your money? Money is energy and it is very important where you put your energy. Today we will talk about very important crucial points when it comes to getting rich and being successful in general and keeping your wealth, so to say, and multiplying it. So make sure you watch this video till the end. I'm Nadia and on this channel you can learn a lot about business and cell development, so consider subscribing to this channel and hit the notification bell not to miss future videos, which are coming every Wednesday. One of the typical mistakes when it comes to how we deal with our money is we start to spend more money when we earn more money. And at the end, we don't have any money, because no matter how much we work and earn, we spend it all and we don't have anything left. And then there is no difference between us and a poor person who maybe earns less but also spends less and at the end has also <laughs> nothing. Yeah? So if you want to be like a money, you know, attracting magnet, then you need to save, invest and donate your money. We will talk more about it in just a second and before I would like to say that very often people don't want to save, invest or donate because they have this kind of feeling that they want to have it all. You know, this kind of greed, so to say. And greed comes from your fears. You, know? you have this fear that you might lack something in the future. I have a separate video on how to work with your fears. Make sure you check it out here after you finish this one. But it's just good to understand that this idea not to put your energy, your money, into something productive comes from our, you know, emotional states which are not always stable and that's the reason why we think that we have to grasp and keep everything for ourselves. So it's not enough just to work on your financial freedom, you need to work on the freedom on the emotional level, you know, psychological level, not to be a victim of your own, you know, emotions that keep you poor. Instead, enjoy everything what comes into your life. Make sure you invest your energy into something productive, yeah, you do something, and then what you get, you need a good balance between giving it to yourself and giving it to others. I myself enjoy donating money every month. It's not about how much, it's about the percentage from how much you have. And it's good to have separate accounts like for saving, investing, donating, for having fun, yeah, because it's also important that you enjoy life, that you do things that you like. So this way you can make sure that all of your, you know, different departments of your life are taken care of. And one of the typical formula of how to allocate your money can be that you save and invest 10% of what you get and then you also donate 10% of what you get. And when you follow this strategy, you always get more. One of the reasons is also that giving makes you happy. I have a separate video on that one, make sure you check it out. It's psychologically proven that when you give, you become more happy yeah? because this feeling of richness when you share gives you a lot of good you know, emotions and um, well-being in general. When you give, you have the feeling that you have the surplus and this is a very great feeling to have. If you want to be rich, you need to take care of both your financial situation and what happens in your mind and therefore my book on personal development can be a help here. Check it out. It is in the description below. It's on Amazon. Hopefully it can give you the understanding on how to develop in your life so that you can be more happy and more useful for others as well. So when you donate, when you give, yeah, and also when you save and invest for your own future, then first of all, it's good for you. It's good for others and it makes you a money magnet that attracts more energy, more finances. If you invest into something, you get something back. 
if you want to get something, you need, you know, to take steps, to take action. And sometimes in return you get something else, but still something interesting, you know, new possibilities come. And this way, each time you give away something, you open up for more, you know, opportunities and richness and possibilities, new connections. Even you don't see it, but it works like that. Make sure you follow this simple formula of becoming rich and becoming useful and successful and a happy person. If you watched this video that far, it means you liked it. So I just really ask you to like this video because this way, you know, YouTube will show it to more people that can benefit from it. And let me know if you have the habit to save, invest or donate some portion of your money or if you are thinking about using this strategy in the future. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel and hit the notification bell so that we can meet again next Wednesday. And meanwhile, watch some other videos of mine on business and self-development here. And see you next Wednesday.